she claims to work with Charlie Ward uh, or for Charlie Ward she claims to work uh, under Trump and her how she uh, communicates and, and how she knows she worked for Trump is that she gets emails and she sends emails to a Proton Mail account um, which could of course be anywhere that's her contact to America and I'm sure Charlie Ward too she claims that she's doing God's work and that she is going to be responsible for emptying the dumps with her team of Navy SEALs I can do my job which is get these motherfuckers sorted and get these dumps emptied which is where I step in with my teams she runs um, eight uh, telegram channels she's got a YouTube channel um, she disables the comments overnight uh, and this is because what she says is to give the moderate, moderators a break. I wonder what the moderators need a break from. Um, they're, they're, they're incredibly overworked, making sure no truths or any critique of herself and Charlie Ward, etc., slips into her into her chats. She made a threat um, that she was going to have me or Paul, uh, as her um, intelligence has told her, um, she's going to get um, her six foot bunch of six foot five guys around London to come and anally rape me. And just in case anybody's uh, MI5 that's named Paul, that's been hounding uh, one of Charlie Ward's family. So claiming that I've been attacking and hounding Charlie Ward's family is just simply not true. Um, if anyone can share any evidence that I've ever uh, attacked or hounded Charlie Ward's family, I mean, please share it because it's not there. Um, it's, it's just fabricated and it's again, uh, another manipulation technique um, because she knows people won't even check that. Just in case you're watching on here, we have your names. We know where you live. We know everything about you. Paul, who you know, we know who you are. OK, let's just remember we know who you're working for, Paul. OK, we know who you're working for and your organisation is a fucking great organisation. And you're a little shit fucking scrote that's in it that's not going to be in it for long, are you? So you go targeting the person with the letter C anymore, and I'm going to show you, I'm going to rip you a new fucking arsehole. And I'm telling you, I fucking will. I don't need to do it. I've got bunches of fucking guys over six foot five hanging around in London that will just rape your ass as soon as they look at you. Your choice, you decide. Um, no joke. So yeah, she claims that she can track anyone. She can track anyone because she's got access to quantum um, quantum technology. This quantum technology can pinpoint everyone, and this is how she knows um, who who everyone is, including myself. Uh, she can find anyone. Quantum energy system, which basically we can map and track um, energy. So we bypass quite a lot of stuff when we need to get an imprint on things. This is the easiest way I've been trying to explain it to you. It's basically magic, okay. Uh, the problem is, is, is anyone that critiques her, if they haven't got blocked immediately, which usually happens uh, in all of her groups, um, she will viciously attack them and threaten them. Um, she will use many buzzwords, and this is this is how she's maintained a following by being extremely manipulative. Uh, these buzzwords will be, well, you know, I work for for Trump and for God, so you chosen your side. You 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 working for for you know demonic entities. Etc. Uh, Etc. Et and she will swear and she will say we know who you are. We're coming to get you it's more than she probably says paedophile more than any other word in a sentence She uses that and she uses um, Just vile language and, and she's so assertive and threatening um, She literally says we fuck we know who you fuckers are. We're coming for you uh, We know what you've been up to all the kiddly fit kitty fiddling and whatnot um, And we know all about it and Trump's got all the information and we're coming for you and and people kind of eat this up and they see how like say passionately threatening she is and believe that she of that she must know something so yeah anyone that attacks her she she viciously attacks and then she will then make up one of the agencies and say that we know you're working for mi5 mi6 the cabal um you know uh, cia uh, mossad she will say anything you know just in case anyone's watching from this cia that contacted me the other day who pretended she wasn't um to 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 try and paint a picture of you oh yeah you're obviously intelligence because you don't agree with me um so you you know and we know this and we know what you've been up to and we're coming for you and people um people just you know run with what she says because um you know she's saying that she's working for trump and she's helped saving the children so she's got to be not lying to you all right 
wrong. A latest claim is that Hillary Clinton has just been hanged at Gitmo. She says this information is coming out within the next couple of days to couple of weeks. So we'll know in a couple of weeks time, you know, if this is all, everything that she says, it, you know, all this intel is absolute bull crap. Charlie Ward had to sign an NTA, NDA to actually get that information. It's officially, her death was at Guantanamo and seemingly, I believe her choice uh, was hanging. Um, obviously, for the real people that know what's going on and when she really went, let's forget about that. Hillary Clinton officially has been obviously tried at Guantanamo and um, officially, I think it was hung, okay? Unofficially, I think you'll find that a few of us knew what was going on anyway long ago, but the bottom line is, let's say for the official people and what's going to be coming out in the mainstream not me she said that charlie ward has signed an nda of course he has to get this information but uh, we all know that she actually died a long time ago but um yeah this is what's officially going to come out this is what's going to be official so let's see if that official information comes out are we i'm sure if you're watching this video back two weeks later you'll, you'll see uh, for yourselves she absolutely idolizes charlie ward and i think this is part of you know feeding into her delusions i think this one fantasist uh, fueling another fantasist perhaps i'm starting to get lots of people asking me for interviews now and ask charlie for interviews charlie has just spoke to me 10 minutes on the phone and i'm officially allowed to tell everyone that he has spoke to me and officially we have the proof that she's gone charlie i gave him a call tonight and charlie um has signed an agreement so um the contract has signed that he knows what information he can say and what he can't say over the next coming weeks and it has to be done in an intel drop correctly you know the likes of charlie who i absolutely adore i mean this woman says that uh, charlie ward has recently accepted um chief of staff under uh, the job of chief of chief of staff underneath donald trump i don't think any of her followers really believe that surely I, I hope you don't believe that there is a way of tracking energy so when badness dark energy um threatening behavior happens down the internet or um in person even and it can be anything like it can be anything like from something you touch or whatever you can scan it through this technology we've got and we can literally find people or situations and um, it's quite crazy but it's true um donald trump has all this equipment i happen to have quantum which means i fucking know who you are and you just didn't know it was possible did you because you lot you cabal you really thought you were going to get that system and you didn't get it did you because guess what president trump and his crew that are coming after you all have all that so they know what they can do and what they can find and what they can not find you know how to map people through everything to do with your energy in your body once i get the go ahead i am going to fucking crack the biggest bottle of champagne ever but the people at special forces that are around me at the moment have just confirmed because this is my second take don't put the names down because they've got the names oh your team uh, told you not to mention them, not to mention their names, did they? Oh, that's that's convenient. Yeah. <laughs> I don't need to threaten you. Uh, anyway, I heard, I heard her talk about this, Paul, um, as well. We know who you are. We know where you live, Paul. And the more she went into it, she started saying, this Paul has been, uh, we know what you've been up to. You've been attacking children, uh, this, that, and the other. And the more she spoke, I thought, oh, well, this one's not about me. So who else is, you know, I know there's lots of people calling out Charlie Ward, and rightly so um in the in the community now um and, and more will come um but i just thought you know this pool doesn't you know align with me i've never mentioned her before so you know this must be another guy i hope that she kind of leaks who this other youtuber or you know personality is so i can watch his videos too um however i later have come to find that um this pool is uh, she thinks is me she has she's putting in a following by saying 
look, I, I talk to Charlie Ward all the time. I am in the UK. I am on the front line. Um, and she says this with lots of swear words in between, but I am, you know, on the front line. I am emptying the dumbs. I know what's real. I know these people and 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 clearly she doesn't have a, a clue just like charlie um so it is it is kind of hilarious but um yeah so she says that obviously the way that she's she's hooking people is she's saying that she's on the front line of these dumbs and will be emptying them and of course she's working for donald trump and the bot bottom line is we all need to go back to our quantum which is to do with our inner being and understanding our inside what's going on i don't know what happened to me but I do know one thing. I I got downloaded some shit that maybe I shouldn't have gotten. It should have been for some fucking Navy SEAL somewhere. And instead they gave it to some motherfucker like me, okay? So I don't know what happened, but I have got a serious download package of some real serious shit. And I am going after that. The intel is already with America. Um, I know that the particular person we all know about, um, he's he's going down reason I'm doing this video I was gonna just leave her alone because I thought everyone will see in their own time and they will see through evidence given um, you know that, that's the 30 reasons why I don't trust Charlie Ward etc and then they will see that she's idolizing this guy and apparently working for this guy this is this is her boss so they will soon go you know what, what a nutter and stop watching her but um, unfortunately uh, she's for herself she's come into uh, my telegram and viciously attacked me calling me uh, Paul uh, a paedophile working for Matt Hancock, um, just a bunch of just, but everything that she ever says is never evidenced. Um, and I, guys, please prove me wrong. Anything that she's ever said, any intel she's ever given has ever come true. Um, please share with me. Today, uh, while I was doing what any normal person would be doing on a Sunday, um, seeing family and you know not really paying attention to my telegram, she for about uh, two hours uh, whilst I was busy, she jumped into my telegram. She left about uh, fifty odd voice notes. Um, she called everyone in their paedophiles. Um, she was uh, as she usually is, extremely um, foul mouthed, and she was just presented herself awfully, um, but. She then brought, when she got some, some kickback from people saying, hang on a minute, you can't come in here and say everyone's a paedophile. Um, she then brought in the cavalry, as she said, and brought lots of people over and then asked them all to report the channel. So what resulted in that before I could then get on and respond was comical, was YouTube gold. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to play messages and again I'm, I'm having to rate this video as uh, 18 plus for foul language all coming from the great british foul and uh, so guys if you are not prepared to hear a lot of f-bombs etc and a lot of threats and and some just utterly horrible behavior um please stop this video now because she is vile hi paul i'm just leaving this message for you truth seeker all right um obviously we know who you are, and um, I'm just letting you know now. Obviously, we've located a few other of you, so we're going after them tomorrow. Uh -huh. All right, so you can bleep me all you want off this, but we're going to make sure now, from now on, if you go after ch children, which is what you've been doing, you've been going online and going after children, innocent children, and you're not going to get away with it. And as you know, it's my job to stop all that. So I'm sorry, this is going to stop. If you're going to have a as I know, it's her job to, presuming I'm Paul, which I'm not, as well, as I know it's her job to stop all that, I don't believe that for one second. Um, you know, I, I don't believe at all that this woman, um, you know, is, is in charge of stopping all of uh, the paedophilia out there and emptying um, dumbs full of children. Uh, she even says that, um, you know, there's incoming intel over the next few weeks and that Charlie of course, on the phone to her and said, look, I'm about to sign a military NDA, of course. Um, no, I, as I know that she's involved in all this, n no. Um, I've only just heard about you two weeks ago, and to be honest, you are not. Um, let, let's carry on, I won't go further. Paul, against adults, that's fine, but you don't bring innocent children into it, end speaker. Paul, okay, see you later. I know that MI5 and MI6 are good organisations, but when you've got people... Okay, so let's stop it there. She's talking about um, she know what you don't bring children into this. I've never brought children into anything. 
where is this coming from? I am all for saving the children. You know, it, it's just nonsense. Uh, and what it is, is it's pinning things to me. It's trying to trigger, you know, put trigger words in there. Um, you will see this more as it continues. They work within an MI organisation and they're setting a group up like this and they're going after men that have got innocent children. That's when the fucking, that's when the fucking cookie crumbles. And I am right. So that's where the cookie crumbles. You can't go anywhere after anyone if they've got children, right? No matter what they're doing, the cookie crumbles because of the children. What? What children? Well, they have children. A lot of people have children. A lot of lot of bad people have children. What are you on about? Not scared of any of you motherfuckers. So I'm going to tell you now, Paul. Okay, don't set a group up like this and pretend to everybody you're an innocent bystander when you're feeding fucking shit out to the masses, all right? MI5 and MI6 are good organisations, and you know damn well you work for one of them, all right? But you're working as a rogue operative, okay? We are good. Okay, so if I worked for MI5 and MI6 and I was a rogue operative, do you not think they would shut that down? How dumb do you think that the MI5 and MI6 are? Like, seriously, do you not think if I was going rogue and doing this and I worked for MI5 and MI6 that they would not shut me down? You even say that they are a good, you know, they are a good organisation and you're smearing their name by doing this. It makes no sense, Claire. Seriously. I'm going to make sure we go public with this to everybody. If I was you, I'd run to the fucking hills, man. No, I didn't Not say running that. anywhere. And you know, I didn't say that. And you know that, Mr. Chow. We know who you are as well. Right. So someone in my Telegram had piped up and said something. Um, and immediately she says, no, 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 I'm not saying that, Mr. Chow. And we know who you are too. Yeah, of course you do. I'm sure you know everyone in my Telegram chat. I'm sure that you have the background information on everyone. And that's why you're desperately having to come into my Telegram chat and leave uh, 100 or so messages. Right. 